Hi friends, how are you? I hope so that all of you are enjoying my videos. And again, uh, I have come back, come back with the same uh, kind of examples, uh, area related to the circles. And often here, now, they are asking the questions uh, since from 2017, 18 and uh, 1819 two times in the two academic years you are asked the questions on this and in upcoming year this academic year also you will come up with definitely this year 2020 21st GPS year 2000 that is 2021st definitely they will may ask this question also regarding area related to the circles very important to tackle these questions see the question asked here find the area of the senior region not ask the unshaded reason. Shaded reason means this is. Can you see this? Pink color, the shaded reason. The area of this shaded reason. In the figure, the given figure, if PQ is equal to 24 centimeter, PQ is from here to here. 24 centimeter from here to here means this length. Okay. And PR is 7 centimeter. This PR is 7 centimeter. And O is the center of the circle. This is a O is the center of the circle. This O is representing here center of the circle. See here, before tagging this one, we need to find the radius. Means here circle is there. So this this RQ RQ1 representing here diameter of a circle. This RQ RQ1 is representing here that is diameter you know that is the diameter is the two times of the radius means OR plus OQ is equal to that is RQ RQ is representing here a diameter OR and OQ is representing the that is the radius of the circle why I am discussing the radius because we need this that is the diameter why because they have asked here the area of shaded reason. Where is the shaded reason? This is exactly half part. In this half part, the shaded reason is there. So, if you find the area of the, that is a half semicircle, then you, you can minus the area of this triangle. If the triangle is representing here, RPQ or QPR. Okay, or it is QRP. It is really is representing a triangle if you subtract the area of the triangle right angle triangle in semicircle area of a semicircle then you definitely will get the area of this shaded reason so we need to first know the formula for area of circle then only we will get the area of a semicircle then let's see the solution what is the solution solution what is the solution for this question See, we need to find first that is diameter. So uh, we go for first. See that formulas. What is the area of the circle? Area of the circle is equal to five r square. Okay, this you can put that equation number one. Okay, then here if you divide this one means any set means semicircle. A circle, the half of this half area and plus this half area complete will, come, will be a that's area of a circle. Means half you want to take it will become a semicircle. Half means semicircle. Area of semicircle is equal to by r square by 2. Half of the area of the circle will become a semicircle. Plot that one. This is the question that is equation number 2. Okay. That's why I am discussing it. If you subtract the area of the right angle in the area of semicircle, then you will get the area of this shaded reason. That's why I am taking this formula. So, what is the area of this triangle? Right angle triangle. That is area of, of triangle. Triangle is equal to 1 by 2 that is base that is base into height b into h 1 by 
to base into height of 1 by 2 into b into h you can write in this way also okay you can multiply this b into h also but my point this is a third equation so what we need to find here we need to find the area of this triangle then area of this semicircle then you can subtract the area of this triangle in semicircle area of semicircle then you get the area of this semicircle so we want to find the area of this triangle then base we have here what is the base rp is a base height we have yes we have a height also we have i no need again then why we need this that what your radius we need why because here yeah, see this r is equal to radius of a circle but they are not given here this qp is not representing the diameter or ring that is a or else it is a radius or rp is not a diameter or else it is a radius so rq is a diameter means it is passing through the center of the circle means it is a from one point of the that is on a that is that is what you call the circumference of a circle and another point on it that is circumference of a circle the point is a passing from the center of the circle from one point to the another point that is you get a diameter of a circle so when you will if you get a diameter then you will get that that could be a you will get a radius of the circle then how will you find so it is according to pythagoras apply pythagoras here apply pythagoras so that according to pythagoras according to according to pythagoras theorem according to pythagoras theorem according to pythagoras theorem that is r q square is equal to r q square is equal to r p square plus that is q p square okay so r q here representing a diameter r q square is equal to r p square we have value of 7 7 that could be 7 that is 7 square plus q p that is equal to 24 it could be a 24 square what my point yes then we can simply by r q square is equal to the 7 square is equal to 49 24 is representing here 24 into 24 4 to the 16 4 to the 8 plus 1 9 so 4 to the 8 2 to the 4 6 8 plus 9 8 plus 9 is uh, 17 plus 3 5 7 6 5 7 6 okay so r Q square is equal to if you add this 576 plus 49, then you get the 15 and it could be 8 plus 8, 12, and this is 25, it is 655. Then RQ is equal to root of that is 625 or uh, RQ is equal to it is it is a exactly square of that shape that is 25 that's why the square root of 625 will be 25 centimeter because both are in centimeter 7 centimeter this rp and this one that's why this is also rq is also 25 centimeter now this rq is nothing but it is a rq is equal to diameter it is representing here uh, diameter is equal to b is equal to 25 centimeter we got no diameter if you got a diameter easy you can find the radius okay yes you can get a radius yes so i will grab now here i will grab this okay what is the value of rq rq will be representing a diameter then it could be equal to that is diameter is equal to 25 that is b is equal to 25 centimeter we got then we know that 2r is equal to b okay so r is equal to b by 2 okay then we will know the value of r that is b 25 by 2 that 
quarter point 25 by 2. So we can keep this one as it is. This one is representing a fourth equation. This is representing a fourth equation. Then we need to find here now an area. By using all these equations, we can easily find the area of the shaded region. How will you find that we can go further? See that. Now we go for that is area of area of shaded region is equal to that is area of semicircle minus which we have to subtract the area of area of triangle directly we can subtract put the equations here area of a semicircle will be here equation number 2 it representing area of semicircle phi r square divided by 2 minus or subtract the area of triangle that could be it is 1 by 2 b into h ok then again you can go for phi ok Phi, what is the value of phi? We go for after all sets phi, you can keep this one as it is. R value is representing here 25 by that is 2 bracket square whole divided by 2 whole divided by 2 minus 1 by 2 B that is representing the base 7 is there. Then height it represents the PQ it will be 24 is there. Okay. You can check here, it will be 2 ones are 2 ones are. Okay. Then, here, you can check here, this value is representing, make it a simple pack. So, 5, keep this one as, as it is 5. Okay, 25 by 2, square of this one will be, it is nothing but 625 divided by 4, and it is again. If you reverse this one, it will be 2 by 1 is there and again it will be a 1 by that is 2. That could be 1 by 2, keep this one as bracket, minus 12 7 that will be a uh, 84 is, will be completely 84. Okay, yes. Now, you can copy this and we grab this. We we'll go for next. Okay, now we will grab this. See that now we can put the value of phi here. That is, this is nothing but area we are finding, area of shaded region. We are finding area of shaded region, that's why it is equal to that is phi is 22 by 7 into 625 by 4. Okay, again it is 1 by. 2, okay, take this one as bracket minus 84. So, 2 ones are 2 11 ones are. Let's check here if it is. Okay. You can multiply, it will be helpful. So you can multiply here. That I will drop here. So this one. You can make it simplify here. I will multiply 625 into 11. 11 I will multiply. 11 5 is 55. 11 to the 32 plus 5 is 27. 
Thank you so 